Hi everyone and welcome to the 19th edition of the group exhibit Hydrogen and Fuel Cell here at the Hanover Messe 2013. I invite you to come and have a seat, drinks on the house. Uh, we have waitresses that can serve you a nice cold drink while we have a great discussion here on the public forum. Uh, we will be discussing quite a great statement the most compact and economical fuel cell for domestic core generation. Please help me welcome the CEO at Elcor, Dr. Manfred Steffner. Thank you. Very much. <clears throat> a pleasure to have you with us. Well, last year was a great year for Elcor. Can you tell us why it was such a great year? Yeah, so last year we presented the first time here at the Hanover Show and uh, a lot of things happened since then. Uh, for example, we received the CE certification for our product Elcor 2400 in um, October last year and since then we are installing uh, the units and uh, the experience is that uh, they are running quite well. So I'm since, in the meanwhile, since 20 years in the fuel cell industry and um, I must say, so these, these are the best systems that I've ever seen, yeah, so far, and um, so. Quite a statement. Well, for those that are not familiar with the Elcor 2400 product, what is it? Yeah, so um, if we go to the next slide, maybe, so it's, um, um, so I can explain a little bit like the, uh, the advantages. First of all, um, so we see on the next slide, <laughs> okay. Ah, no, the next. Thank you. So, um, so here's why um, people are interested in this product. So we have seen in Germany quite a significant increase of the electricity prices in the last 12 years. That was about 73% uh, um, that we have seen. And it, it's expected that um, they are continuing to, to increase by, by 60%. Uh, in the next uh, in the next years and so what our product does is uh, producing electricity from natural gas and helping families to save a significant uh, part of their electricity bill um, by making the um, so their own electricity so that's the concept basically the exactly. Elcor uh, 2400 for those that are not don't know what it is it's a CHP system combined heated power um, that runs on natural gas like exactly. you just mentioned and the whole idea behind it is to reduce the electricity bill, electricity bill of a single family home by producing your own power and your own heat. So you just mentioned that uh, the electricity cost in Germany has raised quite a bit over the years. Yes. Um, you mentioned already that it's over 12 years, it was 70%, I believe. Yes, I, I already said that. So, so it, it's, it, it's if we put that on a year, mm -hmm. yearly basis, exactly. that would be... So it's, it's, it's an average about 6% per year. Um, so that it was in the past and it will uh, continue to increase and only a part of that is like due to the energy transition that we have in Germany yeah so a part of that or a significant part of that is like the normal uh, electricity prices so it will so every year um, so like the use of our um, Elcor 2400 product um, so the econo so the economic situation will uh, will get better every year um. because you see that forecast continue exactly. that the electricity bill will exactly. continue raising um, but one of the statements that you made right at the beginning is that the Elcor 2400 is one of the most compact so exactly. let's get to the basic of it how big is it Okay, so it's a, it's a wall-mounted unit, like in a typical size of a gas boiler, 50 centimeters times 50 times 90 centimeters. So it fits in every cellar. Um, and um, therefore, so and also like, so the, um, the interfaces are very similar to like a normal gas uh, boiler. So which means that the installation is very simple. So and that's also the feedback that we got from installers that they, uh, for them, it's, it's very easy to install. And also the, the installation cost with that. So is um, is pretty, uh, pretty low. So it's a very easy transition mm -hmm. for a, a family owner to go from their standard natural gas production to one of your units. Exactly. And it can always be combined also with like a normal um, gas system, yeah. So, like, if you have like a three or ten year old gas boiler, so you can combine our system with that uh, installation. That's very easy, and also like benefit from the um, um, so from the savings that the product gi product gives you. 
Well, for those that have never seen the Elcor 2400 unit, it's on display at their boot, at Elcor boot, which is located at E51, which is right behind us. I invite you to go see it and see how compact it is, because I must say it was quite impressive when I looked at it. Um, Thank you. And then we mentioned about mm. the economics and how uh, it's one of the most economical, and the whole idea is to offset um, a single family owned electricity use by producing their own. But the only way to be economical is there's a whole formula to that, and you covered that with me earlier. So yeah, why exactly. don't you explain yeah, yeah. to the rest of the, yeah. uh, the public how this unit can be the mm. most economical? I'm, I'm happy to do that. So to be um, like economic with the, like an energy um, system, so they are like um, two, uh, two uh, very important factors. The first factor is, so what we did, we analyzed like the situation of, of today's um, single family homes. So, and what you have, you have like a typical base load. So for, for it's t telecommunication, it's the refrigerator, it's like um, several other things, yeah. So which gives you like a typical base load of about 300 watt, so which is about the same throughout Germany, 300 watt. Um, and then you have like peaks peaks that go higher, so for the electrical stove, for the vacuum cleaner and, and other things. Um, so these peaks so are uh, purchased from, from the grid still, so like the system works together with the grid. Um, and, but we make sure with the system that like the, the, the entire electricity that the system produces is consumed uh, at the house uh, itself. And then, so we see that in the next slide, um, what that what that means so consuming your own electricity that you produce with the system is is worth about like 31 cents yeah so if you take like the electricity price this year in germany the chp bonuses what you what you get and so you subtract the gas price you get to about 31 cent if you would produce more energy so more electrical energy so then you would have to export this electricity into the grid so, and uh, last year, like the average um, price for feed in, uh, feeding in electricity was about four cents. Yeah, so and then you add also like the, uh, the CHP bonus and the, and the tax refund, but still you're ending up at five cents and there's a factor of six. So, better economic using the electricity yourself in comparison with feeding into the grid. Yeah, the second. So basically <laughs> what, what Elcor has done is you've reduced the size of your unit exactly. to match the baseload demand of a single family home. Exactly. So, and, and, so and you're not trying to meet the peak. You say the peak, go on the grid and get that electricity when you need it. But your baseload demand, what you need at all times at your home is produced by the Elcor exactly. 2400. So you can buy it from the grid. You can re reduce your peaks, Yeah. So which would be like definitely the best uh, situation, but this here covers your base load that you have anyway. And uh, so this is, by the way, uh, in the range of 50% of the, of the typical electricity cost, because like the 300 watt is always on during the, the entire year. So since you're capitalizing on your return on investment by getting the 31 cents per kilowatt, what would be the payback for someone that uses one of your units? Okay, so the, the typical uh, payback period um, that, uh, that we have for the unit is like in the range uh, of about 10 years or below. So that depends on, um, of course, on the, on the funding structure at the moment. So there are several states in Germany that already have like certain, um, certain funding for, for this product. Uh, and there's like on the national side, uh, so there, there is like an um, investment bonus in, in discussion, so which is definitely needed to, to, to meet like these, uh, these payback periods. Um, yes. So basically, with today's electrical cost, if we and include some of the funding programs here in Germany, you're looking at about 10 years payback period exactly. for one of the units. So, and there are definitely existing funding programs already. Yes, they do, definitely. Um, and the other thing I, I'd like to get into is um, the fact that you got your CE certification last year, like you mentioned earlier. And so you, as soon as you got that certification, it allows you to actually put those units into homes, which you have done. What have you gained from that field installation process? Yeah, so what, um, so what you're gaining is, is definitely a lot of experience. And um, so, of course, you do like 
so, so we developed this, this product uh, in our labs and tested them back and forth. And the CE certification is definitely a very important milestone because so there, there are pretty hard standards in Germany like on safety, on efficiency of these products. And there, was, there were like a lot of predictions uh, about like the performance of the product. And now uh, we see uh, that these uh, predictions were right. Yeah, so and that the performance in the field is like yeah, the same as we have seen before, and, uh, and that's a very important point of, of validation. So, and this is what we want to continue this year. Um, and um, so, before we start like larger volumes, yeah. So, you b basically the field test, the installation in the field, how has it been received by the installers and the single family owners? Uh, are they liking the product? Is it? Yeah, so th there's a tremendous interest in, 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 these, in this product, yeah, and um, I think the, the concept is, uh, is relatively easy under to understand for, for the end uh, consumer, and, and that's why, like, the interest, the interest is it's, it's much higher than we can deliver at the moment, so that's, that's significant. On the installer side, um, so they clearly see that it's, it's, it's very easy to, uh, to install the, the unit, so it's normally like a training for the installers that's less than six hours or so. Um, so very, very um, simple So everybody concept. in the field has received the, the pr this Alcor 2400 product well. They're yeah, happy with it. And it fits in everywhere. Yeah? So that's... Uh, because it's compact. Yeah, exactly. Um, so by the way, this is a public forum. So you're welcome to ask questions. Just raise your hand and I'll come down and bring the microphone. Uh, I'm sure Dr. Dr. Stefner would be happy to answer to your question, but I'll go on the floor actually right now. He will also be available after the interview at his booth, which is located at E51, which is behind us. But uh, let's see what we have here on the floor. Thank you. A uh, question, uh, can you comment in uh, 2012 on number of units installed and, and what are you projecting for 2013 to get a feel for what the uh, uh, demand is in, in, uh, in the industry right now for that type of unit? So he would like to know how many yeah. units have been installed in 2012 and what is the forecast for the upcoming years? What is, the, is there a demand and what is the demand? What do the forecast looks like? Okay, so um, so what we don't do is uh, commenting on the exact number of units, but it's uh, it's um, already like a significant number that uh, that gives us the possibility to see like the uh, the actual performance in the field. So on the total industry, uh, in I think in in Germany we have like uh, already several hundred units uh, in in the field. And uh, in Japan, like um, with a similar concept, I think we have like in the range of um, almost like. 20 to 30,000 systems in the field. Okay. okay, any other questions while I'm up here? Well, I, I'd like to uh, ask you one more question. What, now that Elcor has its C certification, it has done its field test, it's continuing its field, it's no more field test, I should say, because you're actually installing and those units are running, but it's still a market acceptability. I'd like to know what is your your focus or how do you v what is the new focus for um, Elcor in the next two to three years until 2015 where do you, where are you going okay so first first of all so we want to um, um, finalize like our market uh, validation and then start um, so into the the market introduction uh, phase with a significantly higher um, number of units. So that's uh, that's definitely an important thing, and we believe that especially here in Germany, um, so we have like um, ideal boundary uh, conditions. Yeah. So electri elec uh, electricity prices are high, so people are uh, interested in in high efficiency technology. They're looking um, for alternatives because exactly. their bill is just raising, so raising. Exactly. So that's the the best. Yeah, a price break. Yeah, for electricity costs, uh, what you can do so to to get like into own uh, production and consumption of, of electricity, uh, and and we clearly see that um, that this is a huge market. And what we see is that only for for like this product, Elcor 2400. So we see like a, a market of two to four billion uh, sales in Germany only. So and like significantly more in Europe. Um, so and uh, and uh, we want to be like a significant part of that. So short term would be you want to confirm your market access exactly. by 
your field test in some way, could mm -hmm. finish that, that, and then move on into marketing your product and get some of that big market in the two billion euros that you're mentioning. <laughs> so that's the, the market that's potential. <laughs> so we have some other players in the field, but uh, we want definitely to be like a significant part of that. Maybe the main player, why not? <laughs> Um, so, just before we finish up, I'd like you to summarize for the public here, what are the main advantages of the Elcor 2400 unit over others, and uh, so they really have a clear picture of the product you're offering. Okay, so we have like a, a CHP unit that, um, that covers base load for electricity and heat. Yeah, the heat side, so we have not explained that before, uh, is a very important uh, thing. So we, what we cover is 100% of, um, of the hot water demand that, that you have in-house. That means that the runtime of the system is like 8,000 hours per year or more. Um, and, and this is also like a, a very significant factor to make the, the system very economic. Um, so in, in numbers, this is like 300 watt electricity, the typical base load of, of the electricity demand, about 600 watt uh, heat, yeah, so which is the, uh, which is the drinking um, uh, water demand. Um, so the, the, the unit is connected with a, a simple storage tank in the range of 500 liter, fits in everywhere. Um, it's operating parallel to the grid. Uh, so every peak can be can be purchased from the grid. So it's a it's a relatively small uh, system, easy to install, and um, and um, so from the payback periods, I think the, the 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 best system that is on the market at the moment. And uh, yes, that's maybe the, so the summary of the system. Since it is the most uh, compact and economical, I invite you to actually see the unit once again, which is located at their booth at E51. And uh, please help me thank Dr. Steffner for joining us today. Thank you very thank much. You very much.